High fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those cross watching as well. And welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. Today we're going to take a look at and see what is it that they find most attractive about you. So, what is it that your special person, your romantic interest, your crush, or even your secret admirer finds most attractive about you? This is going to be a general reading, so please keep that in mind. If you're after a personal tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will be listing my email address just below the video here. So let's go ahead, give the cards a shuffle, and let's begin. You come across as someone that they're very enthusiastic and um, very keen on. You come across as someone a little bit restless with a lot of energy here, but a lot of drive. And they like that about you. Okay, they're definitely attracted to your looks here. The way that, you know, the way that you present yourself, how you look, how you carry yourself, the fact that you like to take care of yourself, you like to stay in shape. You've got an athletic nature to you or a competitive nature to you. You're someone who... Um, when you commit to something, you go at it all the way here. You don't back out. You're also someone who's very competitive. They find that attractive. You've got a bit of a competitive streak in you. You don't like giving up. Um, you don't like losing. Um, you're a bit of a sore loser, but you know they like that about you. They also like, they're very attracted to you uh, aesthetically, okay? Your looks here. Um, they like the fact that you like to care, take care of yourself here. So you like to put in the work here. You like to get your hair done, your nails done. You like to wear your best outfits. Or you just like to look your best. Okay, Even if the clothes that you feel your best and most comfortable in um, aren't always dressy or flashy. But you manage to make them look good because you feel confident in them. You feel confident in what you wear. Um, and, it all, and it all comes down to you feeling confident within yourself here. So they find that extremely attractive about you here. Um, yeah, you, you're someone who like, is very adventurous, okay? They find the connection that they share or they find you very exciting, very fun, very engaging, um, energetic here. There's a lot of energy around you, a bit of a restless energy, but they like that. You, you're someone who seems very fun to them. You're someone who they like being around here. You're also someone who I feel like likes to think up of different scenarios. Um, and you're someone who maybe likes to do things a little bit differently here as well. Now, you are someone who they know you have different suitors, romantic suitors around you here. So they get that about you. And they understand that sometimes being around you feels like a bit of a competition or that they have to ward off some comp some competition. So, um, yeah, they like the fact that you, there's also, like, you've got a lot of talents you've got a lot of talents uh, a lot of skills that you're able to pull off here okay they like that you like to give things a go that you know you're even though it's something that you would not necessarily l like to do or see yourself doing they like the fact that you like to just give things a go and then you know decide for yourself whether or not you enjoyed it you know the fact that you're so open here you're so adventurous you're up for anything here. They love that about you. They do. You've also got a very sweet, caring nature to you that they love. There's something about you that they find unpredictable or just unexpected. You're, especially with the Page of Cups energy, you're someone who... They didn't, you surprised them, but in a good way. They didn't necessarily expect you to be how you are. or They didn't necessarily expect, you know, for them to meet you and for them to have connected with you in such a way here. So this person is definitely emotionally connected to you from what I can see. Yes, they're attracted to you aesthetically, but there's also some emotional connection there as well. This person actually cares about you. And they're really attracted to the fact that you're someone who's very caring as well. You care about people whom you love, you care about people whom are closest to you here, okay, and you always make the time and the energy for them here, yeah, you look after yourself and you like to put in the work here on yourself, but you're also very much connected to people around you, um, and you're very appreciative 
of, you know, your friends, your close family, your work colleagues even. They love that you're very uh, ambitious. They love that you're very determined. You're very driven. You've got a lot of passions, a lot of skills. You set yourself a little, a lot of goals. You've got a lot of goals, mini goals, long-term goals, aspirations. Um, you, your sense of, your thirst for your sense of adventure is something that they truly like find attractive about you. Because you're someone who's curious, you want to explore, you want excitement, you want adventure. You don't just want to be pigeonholed into something or you don't just want to be, you know, tucked away in the corner. You want to get out there and you want to see the world and you want to um, form new connections. See, that person finds your energy infectious, okay? Very infectious, yeah. So this person is very attracted to not only how you present yourself, but just your overall energy, the overall vibe, the flow, you know, the, the mood that you put them in, the good mood that you put them in here. You're someone who's very independent as well, okay, with the Nine of Pentacles. They find that what they find most attractive perhaps about you is the fact that you like to do you, okay? And you don't care about what anyone else thinks. I mean, you kind of do, but you don't, okay? It's more so, so as long as you're not hurting anyone, you're fine, okay? And they love that about you. They love the fact that you prioritize you. You prioritize your happiness. They love the fact that you invest in yourself financially, but also with your time, your energy, your resources. They love the fact that you like to look after yourself. You like to take care of yourself. You like to give yourself the time and the attention that you deserve. And they like that you're independent. The fact that you know, you can handle your own. The fact that you're very independent financially, um, you're secure financially as well. And they like that about you because, you know, you're very driven. And your success is a result of what got you there, your drive, your ambition here. So they find that very attractive about you. The fact that you're so driven and you're so... Um, into improving yourself and bettering yourself here. You're also someone who can be very blunt and abrupt, but guess what? They find that attractive. They do. They like it that you're able to speak your mind. They like that you're very truthful and honest, even though sometimes the truth can hurt. But they like that about you because you don't feel the need to sugarcoat anything. It's not that you say things, you know, with malicious motivation or intent. It's nothing like that. It's because you know that the truth he is far more valuable than a gentle lie here. And will hurt less as well in the, in the long term. They love that you can just speak up, that you're not scared to, you know, you don't just pipe down if someone doesn't uh, agree with you. You speak up, you speak your truth, you speak the truth here. Um, yeah, you can come across a little bit blunt, but you're also very intellectual here. You're someone who's able to hold a conversation. They feel very mentally compatible with you. And they definitely find that attractive here. All right, guys, and these are your messages. So thanks for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to this channel, liking, sharing, commenting. Um, for those of you after a personal reading, please feel free to reach out. Um, otherwise, guys, do take care. Bye for now.